Oh my life. July 10th, 1875, in Maysville, South Carolina. In, in 1904, I began teaching Negro girls. In 1923, I merged with Cookman Institute. I, I am a teacher and a leader. I am Dr. Man McLeod
I haven't mentioned any father figure up until this point, so let's build up suspense. A long title for a poem about the internet, the collected work of their contributions. To that end, I wrote this so I could nominate one of your less distressing claims. I hired an editor to explain the grammar so I could transfer it back to you. Let's go and confuse Lloyd Banks with a Vulcan extra and a line behind the other bodyguards. Some particular deadpan congratulations. When you're rich like this, it's bigger than jewelry, greater than any haberdashery. Let's go perform a restless basketball covered Mesopotamia, an air conditioned Oregon trail, petty frontiersmen, Katy Perry improvising with the lampshade when all the bonnets have run out. There is enough spiritualism in all of his features in the sense of the exercise to warrant it being included in his writer along with the two hour period for yoga and the usual rations for narcissism. I am a well-known nuisance and my bitch bad, it says, in the salutation of his writer along with the instructions to revive him shouldn't get too into character. If you can lean, you can lean. If you are underwater, you can submerge. If you are black, you are black. If you assume the worst, it will come back at you, at the very least, in a flashback, where they take a poll about cats and then they make cats. A similar size, size of novelty glasses bespoke, like a bra for your eyes, subsides in a folding chair. The font for ruffles, the mount on which all geography is built. After so many centipedes, on the off chance, someone started something with a gun. When the rest of the trees approached the edge of the property, which was the line with another property, and his father's father had said he would otherwise tear down the trees, which struck at something in his father's persistence in being disagreeable. With his father, as stubborn as he was at every turn, if they were arguing about this property, or if they were arguing about the tenderness of some lottery pick's knee. And his father's father insisted there were no longer such things as reliable knees. And his father said, hold my beer, and went out on the porch and bent down in a crouch and leapt and ran forward toward the edge of the property, thinking as he went that he had once and for all misjudged how long it would take to run away as though he had consulted a map, and the map said, here, hold the distance. Thank you. <laughs>